What's up guys and welcome back to another Little Big Planet 3 video and today we're going to be going back to the Poppet Puzzles. It's been nearly an entire month since the previous Poppet Puzzles video and I do have to be honest, I did actually finish Term 1, recorded it and everything, but there was an issue with the audio so it just didn't ever hit the light of day, which is a shame because I was really happy with how they turned out, but in the last episode we did do the bolts, so we only really missed out on one thing and that's the connectors, so why don't we head in this time and learn all about what connectors connectors are. I knew you were near, as I have a connection to all the Little Big Planet superstars. <laughs> and speaking of connections, let us talk about connectors. Okay then. <laughs> Apparently I'm a superstar. I don't believe you. I'm pretty stinky. I don't think I deserve to be a superstar, but let's follow the bench. <laughs> a little bit of follow the leader here, and where's he gonna bring us? You'll find connectors in the tools bag. Connectors connect things, and your bog-standard connector is your basic rod. Once you've selected the rod, ease your cursor over the edge of the first object you want to connect it to, and then press the action button. Repeat this for the edge of the second object, and hey presto, the rod will connect the two objects together. Okay, then, so easily enough, connectors connect things. That makes it pretty simple. So, like, if I walked on this... Oh, I see. That's gonna travel off, but we need it to stick to this. So, let's pull this up and go into our tools bag, get the connector, and do exactly what Da Vinci just said. There we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There we go. All right, now that should bring us along for the ride, right? Awesome, and there's no gravity with this one, which is quite interesting. And unfortunately, we cannot see ourselves get all the collectibles, because technically I've already played this level. Next, we have string. It's just like a rod, except it's flexible. What you lose in control, you gain in uncontrollability. All connectors can be tweaked once placed. Hover over the string and press the menu button. You might want to tweak the length of the string to be shorter. This will bring the two objects closer together. When you're content with your tweaks, close the puppet with the back button to deselect the attached objects. Okay then, so that should be pretty simple. I'm excited to see what's gonna be after this first term, because there is a second term, and I don't know if they're making more terms after that. But I'm excited to see, is it going to be Da Vinci again, or are we going to have, you know, maybe a new character? Oh, it'd be cool if it was all of the Little Big Planet 2 story characters, because then it would be like, <laughs> next would be uh, Victoria Von Bathysphere. So, let me uh, tweak this, I think? Uh, maybe I did that wrong. Uh, there we go, and now we can make the length shorter, if we pleased, and do something like that. Are we going to fly off here if I let it go? Um, yeah, let's do that. Ouch! Oh, man. <laughs> what a headache. <laughs> wow. Okay. And I guess I got to do the same thing over here as well. All right. That's a really interesting mechanic. And it's like you don't expect it until, boom, you hit your head. All right, then. Let's uh, angle this just right. And then we got to press square to uh, change it up a little. Where is the length? Like, where is that? Hmm. Okay. So maybe it could do a bit of that. Is that gonna change it? No, it didn't. Hmm. Okay. Let me try that again. <laughs> didn't quite do it right. Um. You know, yeah. Now it's doing it correctly. That makes a little more sense. And like I said, this one actually sort of follows gravity, unlike the other one. So we can swing on this all willy nilly. <laughs> That's cool. And whoa, nice land on the on the pad and everything, or the uh, the climbing area. All right. Let's try to get up this. Oh no, I didn't do, quite do that right. Ooh. Yes, there we go. Even if there's no prize, it still feels satisfying. The springs tweak menu with the menu button. Springs are special in that they have tweaks for both length and strength. If I were you, I'd have a play with these tweak values to get an understanding of what they do and why they're there. Okay, so this one's always a little worrisome because even when you're playing with it in game, it can be really, really awkward. But as we can see here, it's sort of like a spring and the spring is sort of are too tightly coiled to actually be able to help us here. So maybe we can change it? Get some manual changing here. So we can change the length and we can change how stiff it is. So we can do that, maybe make it less strengthly? Strengthy? Strength? <laughs> oh, that's strength. All right, let's uh, try this. And then, oh. All right, we're getting the idea here. It's a, it's a little wibbly wobbly, but maybe we could just increase the distance now and that can make our job much, much easier. Just like that, okie dokie. That makes sense. <laughs> we could sort of like not even change um, the strength of it and that'd be make that'd be easier. But here we definitely do, I think. <laughs> a little pinball machine from the looks of it. Um, yeah, let's make the strength a lot higher. 
Oh, there we go. Excellent. All right, now we can go on through. I like that. I love little contraptions like that. It's always so cool to see. I used to go crazy for those kind of things when I was a kid. And hello, Da Vinci. The final connector is elastic, and it's very similar to string connectors, but also totally different. Pull on an elastic connector, and it may have a nice little bounce to it. Attach it to the ceiling and the sponge here. Just like you attached the other connectors. Observe, the elastic tweak menu also has length and strength options. You may have to use both to solve these next puzzles. So this one is sort of a mix between the coil and the string from what I see here. So that's pretty interesting. So let's get the elastic, attach it here, and then attach it over there. And then boom. But we gotta change it up a little. We gotta make it a little shorter than what it is. Uh, hmm. I think maybe we should just make it all the way short like this. See what happens. Uh, nothing, I don't think, yeah. It's weird like that. Sometimes it just doesn't affect it. Um, let's try it one more time. Now it's right. Okay, <laughs> now we can do a little bit. Oh, maybe a little too far. Ooh, ooh, a little longer. There we go. Just perfect. Huh. Oh, man, make the leap of faith in. Oh, man, so many close, close jumps. And we can do the same thing over here, I see. Or I believe. Uh, hmm. Can we, yeah, we can connect this with this. Okay, and then now, let's go back to here and select it here, and then maybe we can do that. Yes, okay, I see, very, very awesome. Oh, not quite, not quite. There we go, and you know, these guys can roll on down. <laughs> I love that little um 3.14159265. That's actually, you know, like a little bit of an abbreviation of pie, and it equals actual pie. Delicious. What's my favorite type of pie? Hmm, I don't even know. It's all four connector types. Try them all out, tweak and fiddle with them, find a favorite, and above all, have fun with them. Hooray! <laughs> That's really cool. The connectors seem really awesome. Let's uh, get this one as well. Are you ready? Uh, there we go. Nice and easy for this one. Oh no, the game don't freeze on me, okay? <laughs> okay, awesome. So I do have a little bit of a surprise for you guys after this first term. I do have some cool stuff planned. So you guys should make sure to stay tuned. I've been trying to keep up with as much uh, Little Big Planet content as possible, but it has been a little difficult because, you know, besides team picks, I just... I don't know too much of what to do, but I do have a surprise for you guys next time around, so hopefully you guys stay tuned for that. Alrighty then, uh, let's loosen it up a little bit, so just so we can make this jump a little bit easier, and then let's, uh, oh man, that was close. <laughs> and now we just need to um, lengthen this up. I mean, we could make the uh, strength a little less, but we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna make it nice and simple for us, and hmm. Oh, I see. I think we want to use the rod for this one. I think it would be the easiest choice. So let's go here because we don't want it to be all wibbly wobbly. That's going to make it hard to platform. So let's do that and then do this. And then, oh man, we got to be really fast here too. It's sort of nerve wracking. Oh, oh no, no, I can't make that jump. It's too high. <laughs> there we go. That should be perfect. Ready? Huh? <laughs> awesome. Okay, come on. We got to make the timer. We got to make the timer. Well, actually, oh, but I want to get that prize. Oh man, I guess I'm, I'm going for it. We're going ham here. Gonna get the prize! Away! Ooh, ooh. And then this, and then that. You just gotta be quick with your fingers. You gotta know your interface. Oh, there we go, excellent. And uh-oh, there's still a lot, lot more though. Hmm, what do we have to do here? Because I can't do that. That doesn't really do too much for me. Then maybe I can, huh, well, what is that gonna change? I'm not really sure. Let's do that. Oh, maybe I could, instead of doing that, here, hold on, erase that on up, Ooh. erase it on up again, erase it on up again, it's not gonna erase, oh, okay, here, let's delete that, and let's do the coil instead, or the spring, whatever it is, and hopefully that'll work, uh, hopefully, 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 let's see, ready, ooh, ooh, why can't I move, I can't move, <laughs> oh no, <laughs> why can't I move, alright, blow up, blow up, blow up, ooh, hell you, and come on, that, oh, that, yes, that did something. All right, I can move again. <laughs> Crisis averted. Oh no, I'm still not quite right. I'm gonna run out of time here. I only have like <laughs> 20 seconds or something. All right, then let's uh, shorten it up a bit. And then make the strength like really, really high. Uh, oh yeah, let's have audio. Okay, let's just make it have a silly noise. Ready, and, ooh, yes, we did it. Okay, okay, that's awesome. I didn't quite do it the way I wanted to, but we're gonna make it in time. Hooray! Hello, Da Vinci. Where'd you go. You are a true puppet master. Quick, 
Don your term one graduation gown and meet me on the podium for a picture. Oh man, it's so exciting. We're graduating from the first term with Da Vinci. Let's quickly, quickly uh, put this on here. Now, I do have it somewhere. Here it is. I'm going to, of course, make it a little bit more my style and put the uh, zebra skin on if I can find that really quick. Here it is. <laughs> We're going to graduate zebra gamer style. Hashtag zebratastic. I love it. And ooh, get a picture and everything. Hello. Awesome! Cool, we have graduated, and that makes me so happy. And there we go! We are now- Quick! Don your term one- I guess, I guess Da Vinci didn't want to finish that sentence. Either way, we are now graduated from the first term! Hooray! Hey there, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a like and sharing it with your friends and family. The support really does help. If you have any thoughts, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. If you're interested in watching more videos, why don't you check out some of the ones on the screen right now? Either way, this has been Zebra. Thank you guys so much for watching, and stay Zebra-tastic.